at this recording for the past hour trying to get to Thrax. I have not done it yet, but I finally have gotten my first damage reduction amp, so I hopefully shouldn't be getting insta-killed on round three. Oh, Jesus. Anyway, I forgot I was recording for a second there. Um, so, this new update is very, very buggy, and I hope that some hotfixes come out soon to fix this. But in the meantime, Gold Crown, imagine. But in the meantime, I just really, really want to reach Thrax. I've seen all the trailers, and I've been to round four so many times, but I can always just keep getting one shot. Here's my build, by the way. Hands of Dawn because of the cell slots. Pangar's shine. The, an the lanterns are interchangeable, so don't don't worry about you don't don't ha you don't have to use that lantern. Anyway, so um, this update they nerfed strikers not enough. They buffed chain blades slightly, they buffed war pike slightly. This escalation is actually wound based, but I'm not going to take a pike into it yet. I'm going to wait till I've, you know, gotten all my damage res resistance amps, then I'm going to do that. In terms of the Thrax armor, I don't think it, any of it's going to be very meta. Maybe the helmet. Or oh, Eco Games, don't waste your revise, I got you. He's probably running the um, Rezakiri helmet. And, you know, just a full undying build. I don't know how to make an undying build, so just keep that in mind. I, will m I might show that off later, I don't know. So, yeah. Um, they added the training grounds, which is actually really useful. So now I don't have to go into a hunt to test my builds. So that's nice. Makes, you know... Oh, far, far out, man. We're getting caught on each other. Okay. First round, we get to see a new shadow touched behemoth. Seems like fun. Alright then. actually reworked the dodging system as well. You know, it's, it's difficult to get used to, you know, an entire new set of timing for it, but, you know. So we're gonna get let's see um thrill of the hunt it's a good one ooh carabac carabac's very easy to destroy with strikers they they changed the um way you get to these islands now they added new flora it's it's very i'm very glad they put this much effort into it but there's so many bugs but you know no you don't let's not fix it eventually the GUI has changed, I forgot to mention that. The menu GUI. It's all new, it's very exciting. I will go into more details on these things in the future. I cannot get a full combo, can I? Jesus. There we go.
possibly annoying. It's just flying around the map like a psychopath. Okay. I guess I'll go kill them. No one, apparently. By the way, if you if you like this and you're not subscribed already, please subscribe. I I'm getting like hun hundreds of views, but then I you know I get like a hundred views on doing this videos, then I don't get any new subs. So I'm wondering where all these views are coming from. If um uh, you like it, please subscribe. The more subs I get, and the more views I get, the more motivated I am to upload videos. So you know, oh a cool shot. That's nice. Oh, okay, I didn't do that, but okay. That's right. Bonk, big boy bonk. Is there anything else that's in this update that I haven't talked? trying to think, but I'm pretty sure I've covered the entirety of this update so far. Oh yes, the fashion. Obviously there's, I actually think the Thrax armor looks quite cool. The Thrax weapons are now going to replace Rift Stalkers in terms of the best Umbral weapon to use, but they're still going to be bonded to Rift Stalkers because the Cunning meta is dead and no one's running up below 20% health. So, you know. Trouser weapons are basically useless. I, but you're using Resicuri's weapons. Yeah, I know. But um, I only use it because the I want. I, I'd rather have Berserker at plus six than plus six on the an eighth on a utility cell. I thought I just did this. Right? What have we got? Um, go time. Ooh, looks like we get to see our Shadow Touch Nezaga. They have they changed the Nezaga's slide to now be interruptible, which is good because Nezaga not only having only having one way to interrupt him when he goes Aether Charge has been rather annoying. All right, I have not made it past this point yet, so let's do this. I'll take that. Oh, hello. I should have taken damage there. Well, let's just, you know. Oh, wow, I messed that up badly. Come on, someone, you can do it. Well, I don't know how, how we're supposed to do that. How am I supposed to interrupt you if you don't even reach me? Oh, there we go. About time. Oh, okay. Mad, mad. I don't even know how this MMA isn't like on a quarter health yet. That's a lot of them. They're both gonna heal. Oh, I got that. All right, I'll take that. Oh, 
Oh, see what I mean about the instant kill? I thought I was safe from that, but turns out I am not. Oh, no. And now we have an Aether Charged Emberman to worry about. Boy, this is going to be fun. I am out of all of the stamina. Someone should raise this chain blade. Oh, no, you got it. And now I'm on fire. He's gonna run off, and well, I know what he's doing now. Go bonk this guy a bit. I don't even know who my target is anymore. Oh! Okay, I'm gonna heal that. Yeah. Two stacks of the bloody... Oh. Oh, okay. Deal 5 million damage to Ember Man. Cut my hands. Oh my goodness. Oh, fire! Alright, let's heal. Stamina, refresh Tempest Storm. Um, watch my entire team get down. Buff this main a bit. Okay. Um, let's not run through the fire! Don't do that. Okay. Oh! Die, please, Emberman. Pretty, please. Pretty, pretty, please. Oh, I'm on fire again. Oh, finally. Someone got it. Oh, yes! We did it! Thrax time! Slopity slope. Um, oh, oh, yes, Alchemist Ball, I'll play that. Oh, 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 oh. Look at this, dude! Props to the guy who come up with this. This guy should get a raise. What in the hell? Oh! Oh, whoa, I'm corrupted! What the hell? What am I looking at here? I'm looking at death. That's interruptible, apparently. Um, I am so confused as to what I'm trying to read here. Is it that that's an attack, alright? Um, I don't know what I'm talking about here. That's an attack that I failed to dodge, yeah. Okay, that's an interruptible attack, got it. And he just went on a killing spree with it, okay. Oh, okay. That's new. 
That is very new. Alright. I have a feeling that we're not even going to get close to this guy. Ooh, half my headset just died. That's fine. I'm not sure when it is and isn't safe to attack. He's safe to charge. Alright. And he's now enraged. Is my headset going on? Oh, there he is. Hello. And he's... Whoa! That's so cool. This behemoth looks so cool. Whoa! Oh yes, we actually... Did we? I'm confused. Oh. Wow. Oh, is he mounted or something? Uh... This moveset is so weird. Okay. Cool. That's, <laughs> That's actually awesome. I'm gonna try and get some free damage in there. Oh, he jumped me. Awesome. I'm pretty soon I'm going to learn to hate this behemoth eventually. Get him, get him with the big boy strikes. Whoa. That is very cool. So you can jump it. Oh, hi. All right. So, oh, oh, okay. He's going in there now. Oh, I jumped it. I took damage, though. That's awesome. Can I... Oh! Hey! Thrax, ladies and gentlemen. I have not... That that is the first time I have fought Thrax. That was awesome, to say the least. He's, he's very, very hard to keep an eye on, but, um, yeah, wow, that is very awesome. He's going to be a lot easier the more I play, you know, the more I, the more damage reduction amps I unlock, but that was very awesome to watch, very cool to be a part of. I'm going to go have a look at his armor, point out the cells. Haven't even seen what his legendary ability's done yet, because I don't even have one of his weapons. Because it's the first time I fought him. Oh man, that's that's so cool. I haven't got this pass yet, but I'm going to eventually take... Speaking of pass... I'll take... Ooh, here we go. Lore. The lore journals. I have no idea what they do. 
I'll take that bounty. I guess. I don't know. No bounty tokens left. Fair enough. So I am going to go have a look at his armor set. Umbrella escalation. Um, two talent points. So, so the patrol test does give you dull arc stones. Awesome. Um, upgrades that one to max. Upgrade thrill of the hunt. Right. Let's have a look at this armor quickly. Greetings. Right here. Thrax. Helmet. Catalyst with a utility cell. Fair enough. This one gives cunning with a technique cell. This I don't think any of these pieces of gear. Because we get cunning with technique, nine lives with power, and cunning with technique. So I don't think the any of these three are going to be any useful. This one might, but we'll have to s wait and see, obviously. Cell... Offense core, I'll just take that, I guess. His weapons, what does the legendary ability do? I'm not even sure what You've which of his weapons are we? going to go first. Let's have a look. Um, okay. To deal umbral damage to nearby enemies, teleport high into the sky, then choose a spot to slam down onto, dealing additional armor damage usable ones. That sounds cool. Probably the first one I'm going to end up buying is the Umbral Strikers, mm -hmm. though, with the Thorax Fractured Realities. Drop from the limbs, drop from the tail, drop from killing him, drop, and then, yeah, alright, fair enough. Um, yep, that's basically it for this video. Thank you all for watching, if you managed to make it to this point. Um, if you enjoyed it, please subscribe and tell people about my channel, because I've said it before, more views I get the more motivated I am to upload a video and the more subs I get then I'll be even more uploaded motivated to upload a video I'll be even more uploaded anyway um, yeah thank you all for watching hope you enjoyed my first time fighting Thrax definitely not my first time doing the escalation though and I'll see you in the next one peace